What's going on, my unit? It's your boy Maverick, the heavyweight champ, Maverick the Enigma McLaurin. Bring you another motivational Monday video today, man. Let's go ahead and dive right into the topic. I'm not gonna waste no time. Figured I'd bring the hoodie back because you know it's about to be fall. Seasons are changing. Allergies are still running up high. I hope everybody's staying safe still amongst the pandemic, the COVID-19 outbreak. You know what I'm saying? Hope everybody's maintaining their safety, maintaining their health, still continue to improve themselves every single day. That's why you come to my channel every single Monday to make sure you get that motivation to get you through the week, man. And for that, I appreciate y'all and I love y'all. But I want to talk to y'all something about something there. Like we, we, something that you know, not just men face, but we all face at a point. In this life, I'm be honest with you. Not everybody you run across is meant to be your friend. Not everybody's gonna want to be your friend. Not everybody's meant to be your friend. You know what I'm saying? And you know, throughout my lifetime, my experiences, I've dealt with plenty of fake friends. You know what I'm saying? There's so many variables. You know what I'm saying that you can factor in to tell if somebody is fake or not. You know what I'm saying? But the point I want you to get is, you know what I'm saying, not everybody's meant to be on your team. If they're not cheering for you from the sidelines while you're in the game playing, then, you know, they're not really there for you. They're not really a friend. See, friends are supposed to, friendships, matter of fact, all relationships, romantic, protonic, friend-like, it don't matter. It's supposed to consist of both parties giving and taking from each other. Not one person gives, the other person's take. And that's the problem. A lot of people are givers. There, you got a few people in the world that are givers. But you got a lot of people in the world that are takers. And oftentimes, in order to earn a taker's approval, you got to give them something. You should never have to give anybody anything to earn their approval or earn their friendship. No. Nah. You got to, you know what I'm saying, do th things on your own to make them earn respect. You know what I'm saying? To earn their respect. And once you earn their respect... I can generate friendship from that. You know, a friendship based on you no know, material and favors, that ain't a real friendship. That's a give and take ship. That's a one sided friendship. Meaning, yeah, they'll pretend to be your friend as long as you can supply them for what they need. Yeah. Of course. They'll continue to act like your friend. But are they really your friend? Because when it's time for them to do their part of the uh, bargain, they don't hold up to their end of the stick. I'm just being honest with y'all. I'm just going to keep it 100 with y'all. Just because they're all cool in front of you when they smile in your face and, you know what I'm saying, they shake your hand, give you a hug when they greet you and all that, that don't mean they really your friend. The same person could be saying something bad about you behind your damn back. <laughs> you never know. You never know. Because people these days, they don't know how to keep the same energy. Like, if you don't like somebody, I don't expect you to hang around them. If you're not deep, if you're not cool with somebody, I don't expect you hanging around. You see, and this is where most people mess up. They think everybody they cool with is their friend. Not everybody you cool with is your friend. I have so many people I'm cool with. It's a long list, but it's a way shorter list of people I consider friends. You got to draw the line by yourself. And most importantly, it's not even just that. You know what I'm saying? It's not even just that. Even on this YouTube thing, man. I know I got at least 20, 30, some of y'all tuning in and watching my videos every single day. Some of y'all catch up when y'all need to catch up. You know what I mean? And I appreciate all of y'all the same. I appreciate you all. Because y'all still are part of the subscriber, folk. Just like how I treat everybody that's cool the same. But if you've been rocking with me for a long, long time, and you've been supporting me since the ground up, I'm going I'm to make sure we eat together. You feel me? It's a team unit, man. Like my man Q Speaks Facts, man. He, he's one of the most brightest young men I've ever, I've ever met. The guy's only, he's about to be, what, 17 this month? Shout out Q Speaks Facts, man. He, he, he been a real one. You know what I'm saying? Me and him. Constant conversations, be sharing information, you know what I'm saying, about how to get, you know, our YouTube channels, you know, completely off the ground, especially him. I'm, I'm giving him game of how I got started. 
You know what I'm saying? And he's giving me game back. You know what I'm saying? And he has this saying, and I reacted to his video where he said, "Don't nobody want to cook the food, but when 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 dinner when it's dinner time, everybody got their plates ready." You know what I'm saying? That's another way you can garner fake friends. If they if people notice success, because people in general are attracted to a successful person. If they are, if if you are successful in any area of your life, or you're on your, or you know, some people they come while on your way, but most people they come while you're already there. You know what I'm saying? That just proves the theory that you know they weren't really down with you during the struggle. If you knew them while you were struggling, and they weren't messing with you. They ain't down with you. They ain't down with you. They're only down to reap the benefits, but when they ain't, they ain't even put in the work in. They didn't even honor the responsibilities. To get to where you're at. They just want to share. They want to eat off your plate. Don't don't let them get too far. You can still be cool. But don't get too close. Like I said. People don't know how to keep the same energy anymore. Me. I'm the same guy. You know what I'm saying. Regardless of who I'm going to go. Regardless if you're cool with me. Or if you're a coworker, Or if I'm just or I'm just friends with you. Or if you're in a relationship. I treat you. As far as I'm concerned. And that's. You know what I'm saying. <laughs> I treat everybody the same. Family member, it don't matter. I keep the same energy. Let 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 let's let us, let's set a new example. If the people knew how to keep the, their same energy, the world would be a much better place, and there'd probably be little to no existence of a thing called fake friends. I'm just i I'm just letting it be known. Fake friends will continue to be a thing. As so long as they don't hit you up all year and wait until the holidays to hit you up. Fake friends will always be a thing where they're always asking you for shit and when you ask them for shit, they don't give it to you back when you after you gave it to them when they asked for it. Fake friends will always exist when you're at the highest peak of success and everybody wants a piece of your pie. Even though they didn't do nothing. They didn't support you. They didn't put pitch in no pennies while you were in the struggle. They didn't do nothing. But until we can learn to keep the same energy, hey, there's always going to be some somebody out there that's, that's a fake friend. So, more of the story. Pick your friends wisely and be careful who you let in your circle because you don't know if they're smiling in your face and talking to you behind your back. Or if they just looking for a come up because of how gullible you are. Just read people. Read energy. This can lie. Lips can lie. But energy don't. Vibes don't. You understand? You feel me, E-Unit? All right, now. And that's it for today's Motivational Money video topic, man. You, uh, If you guys enjoy this, go ahead and drop that like. If you're new, go ahead and subscribe. Join the E-Unit. Um... This week, I'm going to probably work on getting an Anchor FM, so that way I can start my podcast on Patreon. I'll probably uh, start throwing that in my regular description, and um, I'm going to try to get a Teespring account, so that way I can start uh, marketing some of my catchphrases, just like this one. For those of you that watch this video, remember, heal yourselves first, be a better you. That will be a t-shirt. Heal yourself first, be a better you. Till then, take care. Love y'all. Deuces.